Good afternoon and welcome to Satisfactory. Uh, starting off a, another uh, special afternoon stream, mostly because I have a day off. So, last episode, yesterday, uh, I planned out a way to use this oil area, or this, the oil from this area, to create a, uh, power plant. A, not a fuel-based one, although that would be ideal, but... Um, I don't think I have enough of this. Uh, which apparently I need to do some more planning. Uh, so, yeah, I ended up going back and getting all the materials that I would need for the buildings. The only thing that I need to do right now is to get enough to build the other things that I'm going to need. Uh, for instance, uh, I'm going to need some copper sheets for the uh, piping. I am going to need probably a, a bit of cable and I'm going to need lots of concrete and iron plate. So I'm going to run back and get that. The environment is awesome now. The fact that you actually have environment like the wet slick Foundations. It's pretty awesome. Oops. There. <clears throat> yeah, so today I am hoping very much to. Uh, apparently stall out because I ran out of fuel again. Nope, that's not wrong. There we go. Let's try this again. There we go. It helps to have fuel for your vehicle. I'm gonna end up using up all of my solid biofuel for this. Rain in the desert. unplanned.
I'm just hoping this uh, stream ends up being alright because there is some workers out front of the house that are working on the drainage pipes right outside of the house and it's I can feel the house shaking from the machinery that they're using Okay, so what did I need again? I need copper plates. No, copper sheets. I need copper sheets. Not that many, I think. Uh, I am going to need some cable. I'll grab a couple of wire because I'm not sure if I need that. I am, however, going to need quite a bit of this. I'm not sure how many, but we'll... I can always bring back what I don't use, so... I need anything else? I don't think so. Now I should have enough, I think. <coughs> Ugh. Every time I end up coming through here, I end up hitting him because... It appears right at the last second. way. out of nowhere. Literally. Alright. Let's see if I can navigate through this and not launch myself into deep water.
Is this the right spot? <clears throat> no, that's not the right spot. It's this one. That's the right spot. Fifty-five solid fuel just to get there and back. <clears throat> All right, so first things first. I need twenty refineries in order to process this crude oil. This might actually <clears throat> be in the way. I don't want to use up the The area over the water and I'm not sure if I want to go straight up how much space does a refinery take up uh, what do I need for refineries Take one of each, I guess. See how it goes. I'm thinking I'm gonna put these here. Where's the bottom of this? Like here? See, I only need to not use up the area that's right at the water. Because what I'm thinking is that there's a lot of water access here. I could literally put um, water extractors everywhere and collect up all the water and send it over to a base. Uh, so I'd like to leave myself open for that. All right, refineries. I need refineries. I don't know how much space they take up. room to move around and that's not going to be enough how much space is there sideways so they take up more than one so what if I did this
like that. That should allow me to <coughs> get over these rocks without actually having to get over the rocks. So this takes up just over one space, right? So that means I need at least 20 spaces plus uh, like one or two. And I th think that was 20 spaces. To there. They're not staying there, so that's fine. I'm gonna have to get rid of all those trees, but... So, that's ten. That's 20. So this is 22. Okay, so let's say I do one more this way. Can't do the same thing below it, but doesn't matter because this is just going to be a um, kind of a platform. And I'll try and get creative with the uh, the walls to make it look like it's supported. And then this. Like this. There. Now. I want at least one space to move around, uh, a partial space to pipe things up, and then the same on the other side. So it's going to come in this way, go out that way. Uh, it's 10 and 10, right? So 10 of them are going to be plastic. take all of those. Yeah. 
no idea. So how many did I get? <coughs> One, two, three, four, five. So I need to adjust this. There's 28 total. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that is going to be Oh, I need more encased. It's fine. So that is going to be the This is going to be plastic. And now this, I'm just gonna put a small space in between to separate them out. And then one, two, three, four, five. That's not going to work because of that stuff being in the way. Can I move this? Not really. What I can do is just Oh, I need rods. Do I really need rods? Oh, wrong way. See how fast I can empty this. Did I unlock? No, I didn't unlock the Mark IV belts yet. I unlocked manufacturers. nothing else 
yet. And I did the Mark II pipelines. But other than that, I have yet to unlock more stuff. Yeah, I should have thought things through a lot more, but, well. I don't exactly do that kind of thing. Okay, I did the math before figuring out this, so that is as much thinking and in some cases that's more thinking than I actually did do now the next question is how all are these I need to fit six more in here I don't think I have enough space one two three four five six oh barely I have room on the other side Yes, I do. What I can do is that. And instead of this being here, that's going to be here. Because that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I need to change this back up one. I have 16, right? And I need 20, so I need 4. Which means I should have 8 left. Well, that's doing that. I can do this and set this up for rubber.
I did this wrong, but whatever. Doesn't matter. Hoping this helps a little bit. In that it's offloading one of them first, and then. Uh, what I think I'll do is. done yet all right that's that one done now this I'm going to change things What I'm going to do is, I'm going to put that one to there. That one to there. So that I'm filling it at twice the speed. I mean, it's going to empty it twice the speed as well, but what I should have done was hooked both of these exits to one and both of these exits to the other, but I didn't, so I have to live with those consequences. My ladders because I would like a way of getting to and from this without having to move floors It's getting there. Come 
Mark IV belts would make things so much easier. We're going to be close to be finishing. If this is sorted. Oh, because it's going backwards, right? Just a second, I'm gonna wait for this to finish. Okay, I just thought I'd open the window a little bit, get some fresh air in here, because uh, according to my watch, it's 8 degrees outside, according to the thermometer downstairs on the back deck, it is... 10 degrees out in a shady part so I would like to monopolize on that fresh air the warmer air hopefully I'm really hoping springtime is soon Okay, I was gonna test out, so I don't know, not there, okay, that misses it. That does not. Does this miss it? Miss it? Does that work? Six, seven, and hit almost eight. That's still going to end up having the smokestacks going. I had a better selection of blocks. It would be better.
Uh, we'll go with that. Um, I really only need two floors. And the higher the floor, the harder it's going to end up being for me to actually make stuff. So, because I'm going to have to have pumps to go that height. And the higher the pump, the or the higher the height, the more pumps I'm going to need. Now, I do have the newer pumps available to me, but uh, I think those need motors. As most stuff does. So what I'm thinking is... This floor can extend out there. As much as I need to get through this. So like one floor is going to be going in one direction and the other floor is going to be going in the other direction. perpendicular to it. I'm thinking that might break up the shape a little bit. If that makes sense. So instead of it being a box, Uh, I need four more. I need 28 refineries total. So 20 is going to be down here, and then 8 is going to be up there. Okay. Should only need to worry about the last four. Yeah. Alright. So, those are plastic. These are rubber. So, we need to get oil to this. I have one 600 line. So, what do we want to do? It takes the same amount regardless of which way. So what I'm thinking is... Let's 
splitting it twice. And just well, because it's it's fluid, so hopefully it shouldn't matter too much. But what I'm thinking is I'll split this once. Like that. So that gives me hopefully to six hundred lines. Or two, three hundred lines. Under pumps, it is. I need rubber. Wow, I need rubber. Has the rubber in it. All right. So what I'm thinking is need to because this should naturally split it into two three hundred lines right the difference will or the issue is going to end up coming from after that how do I split it further because This works like that. Or should I? You know, it's better just to... No, because if I split it down there, then I can do this. So one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Like this.
and like this. I guess it doesn't really matter. Might have messed up on the spacing of these. I hope not. <laughs> eh, sure, why not? Alright, so let's go backwards. Oops. Uh, no. No, that is not. I don't want to just do an overflow with... I did mess up on the spacing of this, but only because of that. Uh... Yeah, so one, two, three, four, five. So... So if I do this, and I limit this to 150, that should force 150 to go that way, right? think and then I just have to do the same thing on this side This fluid is a bit weird. It's, um... Because it can go anywhere, right? So... Forcing it to go in the direction that you want, you have to be able to restrict the flow so that it forces it. Now... Is that going to be right? I 
And then I do the same thing by putting that there and then restricting the flow to 150. That way is going to force 150 that way. One, two, three, four, five. Right? looks good, but I mean, it works. Eh, whatever. This is center here, right? So one, two should be there. And that gives me a 90 degree. And then that just goes to there. Right? And theoretically, since As long as the Oh, I forgot to hook that up. everything up right Looks a little bit weird, but it's functional, I think. Just because the lines are full, there's nowhere for the oil to go. Alright. Okay, so these pipes are full.
Okay. Uh, I need some power. So for right now, I'm just gonna do this. I mean, I'll have to clean up the power and everything eventually, but I need to see the size of everything first and then see where it goes from there. Because as of right now, I have no idea what else is going to end up being in here. to there, so that at least is done. Water needs to go to the last step. Okay, so these are working at full capacity. So, I need to figure out what to do with these. So, I've got 10 at 20 per minute rubber is 200 rubber. So, that's. So, I'm alright. Um. What I think I'll do is, right now, I'm just going to go, I'm going to put this here, like that. Why did that shut down the power grid? What kicked in? cutting it close. I think what I'm gonna have to do is do half of them first.
and ease it into it because I need more power and the only way that I'm going to be able to do that is to have more power so I, I don't think I can do all of them so let's start with this um, all of them can fit into a Uh, 300 or 270 line. So, So it's that. That links up there. And then this is here. One, two. There, there, and there. That is wrong. Why is that lining up with that? Weird. No idea what's there. <sighs> this is annoying. This is why I hate maximizing stuff, because it just... It's so much work.
Okay. So, I'm gonna replace all of these with just plain ordinary lifts. Cause I only need Mark 1 lifts for this. Alright, so that is that. Uh, but now we're gonna have to go to the other side. And I mean, I might as well. Might as well pipe it all up, even if I'm not going to end up using it right away. If all I need to do is hook up power, get it working. of people coming on and then like two seconds later leaving not sure if it's because of not paying attention or if it's just spam filters are kicking in or something they're posting and then getting kicked out maybe Which, awesome, because I understand you need a, to make a living, but, you know, especially since you're uh, trying to trying to get, get people to go visit naughty sites, but If I have enough room, barely enough room, but I, then I can't get by. All right. Um, well, this would be even with that, right? One, two. One, two, would be there. Yeah. So then this, let's say I do it here, maybe. One, two. And then I just need to line this like no that's too close I think like 
that. And then that I can get rid of. I can get rid of that, that, and that. Then theoretically that should just link up like that. Right? However, one thing that I need to take into consideration is this needs to go to here, and then this, I don't have the AI things. I have to do the same thing over there too. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna take those. Technically, I don't need any of this at the moment. Alright, so this links up here. I need a smart splitter. So it has to go in there. Oh, no. It needs to go like this. Because that's got to go to there, that's going to go to there. Now, this... Oh. Uh. Thank you. Now that I, you know, did the right thing. All right, so now I can access that. So this right is any, this is overflow. And then we're gonna go like this. And like this. Nope. Like that. That's not powered. That's fine. Uh, so, all of this is there. Now, I do have a problem in that that is there, which means that I need to do this. Because otherwise, this pipe would be in the way, and I want to do the piping here. Because this needs to go through. So 10 times 10 is 100. So it's a 300 line? Because 10 times 20 is.
10 times 20 is 200. 10 times 10 is 100. So then it's a 300 line. So I didn't actually need to unlock the extra pipes. Whatever. It's fine. It's all good. I needed it for the oil. And I could really use it for the water. Because it's going to mean less lines having to be run from the water extractors uh, to the... Um, to the power plant itself and that is a good thing because it means less pumps because as it is with 600 meter, uh, cubic meters per second as a maximum I still need like four, three or four of them to do the amount of water Okay, so that is that. Uh, that's a lot of work. But you need to take that up there. If these weren't in the way, going pretty steady honestly
I think... do this. Like that. That's gonna go like that. And then this is gonna be any. This is gonna be overflow. So The problem that I have is that's clipping through. I suppose I can just do that. That's kind of silly as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to see what my minimum is for this. line this up like that if I could see it properly there right Yeah, I like it. And then this just needs to go along Some sink to be like that. Sure, right about there. I probably would have been better off putting that up there. just need to link that up and hope it doesn't crash the entire power grid. Okay, so now, pipes. One, two, 
one, two should be there. That is wrong. Like that. Now. I am going to need pumps. And I don't know where what kind of pump I'm going to need. I don't know if uh just a standard one's going to be fine. I don't know what that green marker is. Just that there's nothing to push. All right. Well, oh. I need a ladder. Can't really see up there. Did I get? Is that the right thing? No idea. Let's try this and see how it goes. something stupid. figure something out. Uh, 
assuming that I have 300 through here. Right? So 300 residual oil is 7.5 refineries. So I, that's why I've got eight going. So I need eight refineries. Which I should have enough for. I'm going to do them sideways from those so that I can utilize the input from coming from this side because I only need residual oil coming in now I'm going to do it here like that. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Now the one issue is that while I have eight of them, it's actually 7.5 that I need. I don't need this here, so I'm going to get rid of this. And this. I'm going to keep this, sort of, because once this comes out, I'm going to line up the, ref the, uh, the coal generators along here in two sets. Whoops. Which I think that should be fine. I'm going to get rid of this first. And I'll rebuild that later. So 
So, since I have a 300 line, I wonder if I should just not mess around with too much and just do an overflow. Because I'd rather have one fluttering than all of them. So, yeah. Uh, let's do that. I'm just going to do... Because this is petroleum coat. So it's just heavy oil in and petroleum coke out. So it's a very simple recipe. It doesn't need uh, anything complicated. Now this is going to be 50%. Now this is going to be... Yes, there. But I mean, even for that, it's fluid, so it's not like I need to worry about... Yeah, let's just do that. And see how it goes. Now, this... This is going to be a little bit more complicated because this produces 900 petroleum coke. Right now my limit is 270 lines. If I could unlock the expanded power infrastructure, uh, that would be fine, but I don't have that luxury. So, uh, each of these is 120, two of them is 240. What did the. I wonder if I should. It's twenty five. It's twenty five petroleum coke per minute for the coal generators, right? So, what is that? Uh, so, 900 divided by 270 is 3.3. Uh, 270 divided by 25 is 10.8 I'm gonna have to 
a look at this math again. I mean, I don't doubt my math. What I um, I'm uncertain on is how I can work through the the belt work. Because because it's nine hundred divided by twenty five is a thirty six, right? Two seventy divided by twenty five is ten point eight. So what's So let's say I do five, two sets of five, so 10. So that means I would need three sets plus six. So 10 times 25 is 250. And I think my biggest issue is the fact that the numbers don't line up evenly because this produces 120 per minute. And that doesn't divide by 25 easily. But even if I did that, well, what's two of them together would be 240. is 9.6 which means I'm gonna have if I do 10 I'm gonna be 0.4 short if I do two sets of 8 Well, what's point four? That's ten. See, so, yeah, I'd have to do some serious belt work to make this work. And... I don't think I can easily do that. So the only thing that I can think of, since I don't have anything fancy, is using a, an overflow that flows into the next one. Just because the math just doesn't work. Unless I fooled around with the numbers and underclocked the refineries so that I had something favorable for the, the numbers and just increase the number of refineries.
If I underclocked it to 100, I mean, it's 33 and a third. So what's Nine hundred divided by thirty-three and a third is twenty-seven. No, 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 no. One hundred. Is nine. It's 300 divided by 33 and a third. Nine. So I only need one extra refinery to do what I want to do. I need motors. I have enough motors. I don't think I do. I think I got exactly the right amount of motors that I needed. Ow. I have precisely one more. Because 100 divides by 25 evenly, which means that every one of these splits into four. And that also should divide everything evenly as well. Yeah. I like that idea better. Because it's only one more refinery. Which, from a power perspective, shouldn't matter too much because I'm underclocking them, right? So... In essence, it shouldn't be that much difference in power. Theoretically, of course. I, I mean, everything works in theory. There's no guarantee that that's going to end up being the way it is. Okay, okay, okay. I think this works. So one of these is going to split into four of that. So what if two of those is 200, three would be 300. I don't have a 300 line, I have a 270. So what if this splits into two merges with that merges with that
this is a 50 line, 50 line goes that way. So then this would be 250 here. which should split evenly. While utilizing the most amount of, or the least amount of belts needed. So that goes there, this goes there, that goes there, that goes there, and then this is just Like that. Now this is going to be weird though. Because I've got... Two sets here. So that's two. And then two. Which doesn't really match up. 270. It would be nice if I had the 480s. That would definitely work out a whole lot better. No, it would still be a pain. Okay. So. I will split this into two. Okay. Then this merges with this. needs to be that and that needs to be that this needs to go to there and then that goes to there and then this is just out here like that And then I've got this one coming out to there like that. So that's 250, that's 250, that's 250. And then this is 150, which is an even weirder number. Actually, you know what? No. 
Uh, I'm going to not fool around with this. Because... I think... <sighs> fooling around with the math... It's probably going to be... And trying to split stuff up. And then splitting it back up later is kind of silly. So, I am not going to do that. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to ignore all of that and deal with these one to two at a time. Because uh, one of these splits into four of the coal generators. Uh, now, I need a coal generator. I need to position this thing here. I guess here is probably fine. Should give me enough room. Now, how much room do I need between? This is one, two, three, and a bit. Yeah, that works. Okay. So I've got a line right in the middle. Okay, so... Sets of four... are easy to work with. And I literally... don't have to fight with it. Three, four, five, six, seven, No idea how many I need, but I don't think I need that much. Uh, we're gonna go with this. Just gonna do that. So 36 divided by 2 is uh, 15. 18? Yes, it's a question, because I can't do math in my head. I'm sorry. Oh, I, uh, no, that's, that's wrong. I can do terrible math in my head. I can also do math that has no real numbers in my head. That's not the numbers. Okay, so 18, which means that I should have 17 left when I'm finished this. Which, I don't have enough space for it. Oh, ah, no, 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 no. Ow. I kind of missed the wherever I was trying to do.
Uh, I need those. And those. According to this, I should have enough space and everything for it, so is there anything else that I need? No. Might as well take this. a coffee right now it's the afternoon and I have to work tomorrow so I won't be able to sleep oh the joys of getting old all right what did I say 17 I should have 17. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 17. Now, That is a lot. And just think, this produces 75 megawatts. So 36, 36 times 75 is 2700 megawatts. So it should give me a bit of a jump from what I'm at now because I, th I really don't think I'm anywhere near that. Because I think I have like uh, three sets of eight. So 24. So I've got a fair amount, I guess. Alright. Can I daisy chain? I cannot. Oh, that's disappointing. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, so there, there, there.
actually there is a mod that allows you to do that which is pretty awesome okay so let's do that now this one I am going to go to here run that over to Oh, I messed up somewhere. Oh, I messed up. Where did I mess up? There's a gap. <laughs> it's right at the start. <laughs> uh, you know what's going to have to happen, right? Yep. Yep. Because cause there's a gap. Uh, Alright, let's try this again. This time. This time without the oops. That way. No. Kind of difficult to see with the uh, darkness. As much as that moon is nice and bright, it is not nearly as bright as it could be. Since this lines up, I should be able to use the fact that it lines up as a count. Alright. Oh, I... I hate myself. No, literally I do. Actually, no. I don't hate myself. I hate my behavior. Hating myself means that I have no redeeming factors. Hating my behavior means that I can change. Okay. So, I'm gonna come from here. Like, oh, this 
hope that I can line this up without actually killing myself. So what I'm thinking is, I do this. I do a double wall there. Pull this to here. This to here. That to there. Hopefully that doesn't interfere. And then... Didn't spill a drop. Okay, uh, so. That's, I'm gonna change to a double wall outlet. That's gonna go that direction for that stuff. That direction for that, and then there's somewhere else I gotta go. There? I think. And then... And then what? Uh, that is... I need to change the location of that, which is fine. So, how about I change that to there? Get rid of that for now. And then link that to there. Okay, these are powered, right? I am cutting it so close. So those are powered though, right? And then those are linked up there. And now I need to take that and run it down the other side. Like, 
that. Right? I need to have just enough to be able to start this going and then these generating power should be enough to offset the power requirements for the rest of the system in theory. I hope. I don't I don't know whether it will or not. I mean So right now my capacity is twenty two fifty max. Oh, it seems to have a leveled out. Interesting. Okay, so water and petroleum coke needs to come through here. And I have no idea how. Um, petroleum coke needs to go out here. What I'm thinking is utilizing the subfloor concept run the pipe along the subfloor just because it's going to be a lot more straightforward whereas the petroleum coke i am going to have to take one of these and split it into four and i'm gonna keep doing that Whereas, if I can get if I can just do like this and then worry about the piping later, uh, that's way better. I like that idea a lot better.
So, like, one, two. Yeah, I do like that. Let's hope that it's not as glitched as it seems to be. Okay, so, uh, this, it would be nicer if they were lined up, probably, but I can't go back now. All right, so I need to split into two and then split off into two. So if I do this, And that, and that, those line up, right? And then reverse this. That. Is there enough in the middle? There is not. Uh, okay, so let's do the opposite. No. Because then it lines up with that. But the only thing I can think of is this. Unless I do this. And then do this like this. 
this. And instead of going straight... So, 100 in is 50 out. So then I just need to come from here like this. So this is there. One, two, like that. One, two. Like that. Right? So that goes into there, splits into two, that way and that way. So one goes into there and it splits two, and then that goes into there and splits to two. Right? And then this... I can just do this... Like that. This. Like that. There. And there. Right? Now, if I pipe this up, I should start to see stuff coming through. Now, I'm going to need a pump. I just don't know. How high? I need to put that pump. Okay, so I wonder if I should just. Uh, I need motors that I do not have, so I'm gonna have to settle for this. So theoretically, if I go too high, I don't get flow because it's not working, right? If I go too low, then it's 
not gonna go high enough. So is that working? I don't I don't know what the head lift is. I don't know what the head lift is, because each of these machines should have their own head lift, right? And I don't remember what that is. Can't reach that to see it. So yeah, uh, apparently I am going to need to put one here. Whoops, no, 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 ow. it in between that's cool So let's do that again. That goes there. That goes here. And then that goes there. But it's not doing anything. Like it's stuck in the middle of the floor. Like I had it before. I I have had nothing but issues with these floor holes. And when I posted them um, on the uh, satisfactory, um, I guess it's like forum within the um, the forum within the uh, satisfactory. Um, Discord. The only comments I ended up getting were, oh, you must have screwed up. You screwed something up. It's all your fault. You did something wrong. 
the game's perfectly fine. There's nothing wrong. There's no bugs whatsoever. I mean, it wasn't the actual developers commenting on this. It was... But I honestly, I have no idea what it is. Okay, so I do this, remove that, I remove that. So theoretically, I have a full pipe right there. Okay. No floor hole. Okay, so, um, I don't know where I need to line this up. Okay, let's just do there there so I have a full pipe going there right and theoretically it should be here and then there all right let's take this out now assuming Well, let's go lower and we'll do that okay now I need a second one here like that I have now is that that's working okay so now let's take this out so assuming that the head lift and everything is fine I'm gonna take this out Take that out. We'll put the floor back in like this. Uh, I guess that's like that, maybe. Okay. So this should, if I go there like that, and I go there like that, then theoretically, this should link up. Right? So maybe I screwed up there. I didn't put it low enough. Well, I mean, it's working now, so whatever. See, my, my issue before was I ended up setting up a power plant. And I did have it low enough. I everything was working fine. 
absolutely fine. I had steady power and everything was working perfectly. As soon as I ended up leaving the area, the power shut off. Like, as soon as I got like, ma like maybe, maybe a hundred meters away, um, the whole power grid shut down. So I run back and look at it and everything's running fine, except for that one water line that was connected to the pump. I pull it all out, I redo it exactly the same, everything works. And then I go like a hundred meters away and it stops working. I and I was back and forth and back and forth and I have no idea what I was doing wrong. Uh it just it no power. What did I oh I th think I took out the No. Okay. The power here. Power is going through there. That's through there. Right? Okay. Power goes from there to there. Power goes from there to there, which those are running. So that's fine. That works. Okay. The awesome sink is working. Pumps are powered. I guess technically I don't need that anymore, but still. Careful, careful. Power goes to there. Do I have power here? I have power here. Okay, so those are working away. I have 100 per minute going into here. So now I just need water, right? I have to figure out the water, but that's, that's fine. Uh, so, um, what do I do with the water? Uh, I better check my math. Um,
Okay. So. I don't have enough reinforced iron plate in my inventory. I may not have enough in reinforced plate total. Um, so that's that. I've got 36 coal generators all hooked up, ready to go. Uh, 13.5 water extractors. How many pipes is that? Uh, so 1620 divided by 600 is 2.7. So I need So I need three 600 meter, cubic meters. So at 600 divided by 45 is 13 point, 13 and a third. is an odd number. So, I think just standard To see if this is lined up properly. Okay. That is not nice. Alright. Uh, I don't think I have a choice in this. I am just gonna have to... Well, what about this? So, that lines up like that, right? There, so one, two. Huh. Oh. Uh. 
Well, that's no good. I don't think there's any configuration I have here that's going to end up working properly. So what if I forego that and try to come from the side? So that would be middle. One, two. Right? So that would be that. Like that. This would be like that. then this can just keep going down the line. So it needs to line up with this. Oh, I need to do it the... No, there's no way that I can do this that lines up correctly. Well, let's say that I do split methods. Oh, that's not going to work either, because the math just doesn't work perfectly for this. Or does it? 300. Divided by 45. No, see, it's... It doesn't work. 6 and 2 thirds. So there's always going to be an amount being dumped. Still, uh, just a second. I'm gonna have to take a quick break. Uh, I'll be back. I'm, just, I'm gonna have to think about this a bit.
Uh, sorry about that. I'm back. The, uh... My mother wanted the cat to go outside for a little bit. Because it's a nice day. Uh, I'm just glad she didn't say that to me. Um... Okay, I did not think on this at all. So I still have no idea what I'm doing. Um, and the math just doesn't seem to fit right. Unless... It's six and two-thirds, right? So if I do... This... That lines up with that, right? So one, two... Like that. One, two, like that. So that's one in, three out. And then I do the same thing for this. line up with that unless I need to go figure out how to get this in. Oh, 
unless I just keep it weird and just do that. I mean, I'm obviously not going to have this be perfect. So, the math is that a 300 line will give me 6 and 1 third, or 2 thirds. So if I do 3 at a time, and then split them off into 3, So, 45 times 3 is 135. So, okay. So, So, 135 and then Thirty-five, which two times so two times one one thirty-five is 270. Wow, it would be nicer if I had these on a belt. Uh, uh, what, what, whatever. Uh, doesn't matter. Um, okay. and then it's split three ways so that should give me steady flow and then I have one third or two thirds of a 600 line so what's two thirds of a so 300 Divided by 45 is 6. Minus... Minus 6 is that. Times 45 is 30. So I would have 60 left over from a 600 line. Right? So 
so um that's fine got 135 split off into two so what if I did the opposite If I'm gonna have a 600 line come through here, then I need three 600 lines, right? Oh, 2.7. So that's one of them. And then this will split off. So instead of doing two valves, I'm just going to do one valve. And it's going to be 135 times 2 is 270. So that should split off into 2. Well, I mean, it, it's, it's technically not going to split off into 2. It's just going to kind of fill up the system. Um, but only the right amount is going to end up coming in here, which is going to end up forcing the rest of it down the line. Okay, so now I need to do the next one. Honestly, I have no idea how I'm going to do that. Because this way that these are lined up is just weird. So. copper plate. Oops.
Oh, uh, that. Speaking of whoops, I don't need that anymore. All right, let's just take all that. I'm just gonna put that back. I'm pretty sure I ended up getting it from there. Uh, uh, there. I'll take all of that. I don't have enough reinforced iron plate for anything. So I'm either gonna have to go back and do stuff, or I'm gonna have to redo some of this stuff up here. I'm gonna just have this go maximum in and leave it at that. That should recoup some of my materials. I still don't think I have enough, but Okay, so that's coming in from there. Now... Uh, this... Oh, that goes to there. Then... This comes down to here. This is there. Now This needs to line up with these three. So can I do something similar? Just ignore that and just do that to because that looks terrible. I liked it better the other way.
That's definitely not it. I'm probably going to do the same thing. Except that that's not going to work. Well, it's going to look funny. I don't care. Whatever. I am sick of looking at it. Uh, so this is going to end up being here, right? Just do something in the middle. That. That. Just a second. Hi. Yes? What? I know. It's terrible, isn't it? It's so nice and warm outside. I guess the sun has gone down, so, or starting to go down. Probably complaining about that because it's probably a little bit chilly. That knife threw you outside. Uh, oh well. Alright, uh, so this is 270 going, going that way. And this should also be 270. Which leaves 60 left over. And I don't care. For right now uh cuz the rest of it's gonna be just whatever um, I need to bring some of these in now I did do that on purpose um Okay, so I need to do this. These do not line up. So that's going to be like this. This is the bottom floor. Uh, so... That means... That this is gonna be like that. Right? And then I need. Three lines.
but you're gonna go up there. Now. These are 120. So 600 divided by 120 is 5. Wow. Huh. I appear to see five of them. Which means I actually was doing some thinking at the time that I was putting these in. Huh. Well, what do you know? rare that I'm thinking things through. Weird. Okay. I do this. Like That. And I'm probably going to need another one up there. Like that. So that goes there. That goes... Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, opposite. So this goes there. Double wall outlet goes there. So then this goes to here, this, this goes to there. And then that goes to there. And hopefully it doesn't crash the entire power system. Power grid. Okay. So. Nine. Should be there, right? this working? It's not supposed to work, is it? Oh, well. See? I knew it was working too well. Alright. Let's try this again. This is lining up with something, but I don't know what it is. Ah, can, ah, can, you, can you work properly? Thank you. I don't need that. What I need is this. To line up with this, sort of. Uh, wherever that is. That's sort of middle. One, two. And like that.
Okay. Everything's full. Everything's good. So, now... I don't have any motors. Which means that I am stuck with these guys, which is fine. They're perfectly fine. Um, so let's start low and work our way up. Okay, so that's one line. Alright. Okay, so... So... Do I need to flush the system or something? No, because according to this, I'm not actually connected. Let's try this again. That is there. And again, issues with the holes. So we'll do this first. and then put this in afterwards. Which is really annoying because the whole point of these pipe things is to go through foundations. Unless it's the foundation that I'm using Maybe it doesn't like the one meter foundations. Okay. So I have water being delivered. I should have petroleum coke being delivered. But it's not getting any, because... I'm 
nothing. It's just taking its sweet time. Oh, that's... Okay, well... It's 45 per minute that's needed. And then... This needs 25 per minute. But it's not producing enough water. Should I not limit it? Just go crazy with the... So just, I'm going to take off the valve and I'm just going to do a full 600 to 6. And see if that changes anything. Sort of. Not really. just going to take some time to do it. Or do, do I just not have enough head lift? So what if I try this? And, oh, this head lift is 20 meters. Is there a flow limit on it? It doesn't say. But this is only giving me like just over 300. So. What if. I took a trip. back to the base and I
Got some motors and some more reinforced iron plate. Because this is fine because it's doing that, but I'm wondering whether uh, this is just not putting the flow through. Yeah, because see, this... No, this says max flow rate 600. So why... Each of these is 120, right? Or am I just too low? get it. I've always had an issue with fooling around with pumps. And the max flow rate on this is 300 meters per minute. This is 120 meters per minute. This is holding steady at 62. Why? You can produce 120. Why are you not producing 120? Is it because I've got mixed pipes? can't see that, but I mean, I can you don't like it, I'll Head lift is exceeded, recommend. See, it says 21.5, but it's based on this. Like, the, I've, I haven't done anything different. And it's complaining about the head lift length, even though I use the default helper guide to do it 
I don't, I don't understand. And it was lower, and it was exceeding. So why? Just why is it doing that? The flow rate's going higher, so, I mean... I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't get it. I mean, it's going higher than 300, or higher than like 100 and something, whatever. Is it making it up there? Honestly, don't know. I mean, the power is going to fluctuate anyways, but. And it's. taking stuff. It's staying full. Power staying steady. I I honestly have no idea what I did. I assume that I had the first one slightly too. I had them slightly too low, which wasn't pushing all the way up there. But, I, I honestly don't know if that's the case. I'm going to leave that there for now. Um... Power. What am I? What is my power like? Uh, two, four, seven, five. Which I think it was like twenty-two hundred before. So I went up like two, three hundred megawatts. How much do these need? These need 30 megawatts, and I've got 20 of them. So I need 600 megawatts for that. Plus, this doesn't say how much power this is using. these use no idea okay well I can't do anything about that um what what am I doing 
Uh, I'm gonna try and get some more of the generators online because I've got enough water for six of them and I've hooked up four already so now I just need to hook up Two of them at least. No. I've got 12 hooked up. I've got 12 hooked up. So I need three more of these hooked up. Okay, so needs to go there one two like that this needs to go one two three four like that oops Okay, so how did I do this? I did one of these lined up with this one with the input on the inside and this is there that goes there now I am limited in the amount of materials I have at this moment in time so I'm going to use 270 belts because I actually have more of those than I do the 120s. Alright, so then this one is lined up with the second one as well. Like that. And then this is lined up like that. So that goes there like that, that goes there like that. Now this goes up here, nope. It does not do that. It does this there like that and then this goes like that and then this can't hook up to this one properly 
so what I need to do is this. goes to there like that but this goes down to here and this goes down to here and then this goes to there and then this can move on and then I just have to keep repeating the process. Right? So, this goes here. The input on that side. That goes there with the input on that side. That goes there with the input on the side. That goes there. I need that to go there, that to go there, that to go... No, not there. That to go there, that to go there. Now... This... Goes there. And... This goes there. Now, I need to wait till it catches up. And this is gonna go. This needs to be here. Like. So that's gonna go to this is fine to go and continue the way that it was. And in fact I'm gonna put this in here, prep for the next one. Now this needs to go in here like that this goes down to here that goes down to here this lines up with that and then that moves on And theoretically, I should be able to line all of those up. I should have enough materials, theoretically. Although it's gonna get dark here. So everything's running. At least so far, so good. I don't even see any major blips on it, except for the, the blips that I had on the other process. I'm up to 3,000 megawatts. I've almost exceeded my maximum consumption and I haven't finished yet so uh, how about I do that uh, so let's do this so there 
there and there. This goes here, this goes there, this goes here, this goes there, this, there to there, this goes here, and then this lines up with that. And then once I finish this, what I'll do is I'll go back through everything and start and bring the other bring the other buildings in. Okay, so this needs to be here. Two, three, four. And then this needs to be here. One, two, three, four. So this goes to here. This goes down to there. This goes to there. This goes down to there. And that's... that's that. So, splitter goes there, splitter goes here, splitter goes there. Clean that out. Mark one belt, mark one belt. Mark one belt. Mark one belt. Uh, this goes here. This goes there. That goes there. Now I need this to be here. One, two, three, four. And over here, which is one, two, three, four. So that goes there. This goes here. This goes here. This goes down to there. This goes down to there. And then this goes to there. Right? And rinse and repeat. There. goes here. One, two, three, four. This goes here. This goes here. That goes there. That goes there. And that there.
Oh, this is a lot of work. But this should at least alleviate some of the power problems that we're having. Because right now I basically can't build anything because uh, the moment I do, I will completely shut down the power grid. I mean, I was already having trouble trying to fix the power grid because... Uh, well, you saw the as soon as the... As soon as I ended up turning on all of those refineries, it completely shut down the power grid, everything. And I'm just lucky that everything decided that it was going to end up working again, because I don't know how many times I've actually had to jump the system, because, like, find a way to have some initial input. Um, of power because the the coal power didn't have enough power to actually start mining and start the water generation Okay. Uh, still, rinse and repeat. I think I'm almost there, though. Obviously, I still have to get the all the other resources in. I still have to run water and I have to these up to the actual um, production facility but this is the uh, the more meticulous annoying time-consuming D all of the above I'm just hoping that all of this actually works, cause I could hook this up, all this up, and just have nothing work at all, and I will have no idea how to fix it. I mean, I usually end up making some stupid mistakes somewhere. Two, three. Uh, actually, I don't need that, because that should just be like that. Oh, this needs to go here. Two, three. 
And I don't need this. Because that goes there, that goes there. And that is everything done. Sort of. Not really. Uh, until I get back here. Because now I need to do this. Slowly work my way back here. Right. This one, now I need that, two, three, because this needs to go to there, and that to there. Now these are fine, one, two, three, because that goes there. That goes there, that goes there. But now I need four. One, two, three, four. Because that goes there, that goes there. There. The cool thing is with conveyors, I don't need to care about height. Two, three, four. So I can go as high as I want with conveyors. The only issue that I would have is just how ludicrous it is to actually have that many conveyors. One, two, three, four, five. So that goes there, that goes there. Would it be nicer to split these up? Yeah. Absolutely. Do I care? No. Because I only care about getting this done because I have already spent way too much time on this. Ugh. And I just, I, I want it done. Uh, how many? One, two, three, four, five. I didn't miss any. One, two, three, four, five. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. And I'm hungry. My mother made me wings. Oh, she made, she probably made herself wings and bad wings and happened to make a few extra for me but I will take it I appreciate everything that my parents do um all right so that's one two three four five six uh, one two three four five six 
This is ridiculous. This is absolutely ridiculous. But I am going to get a ridiculous amount of power out of this. Probably not nearly as much as I think I am, but I'm really hoping that at least it balances itself out. Uh, how many did I make? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm pretty sure that I've messed up somewhere. And... I am not going to find out that I messed it up until I get near the end. And I'm going to be staring at this empty spot that should have something and wondering why it is missing something. Okay, uh, this is silly. But it does work. Alright, so I need... So, uh, one, two. I'm gonna put a support here because I have a feeling that uh, I am gonna have some issues. That's the right way, right? Well, I've already messed it up. Great. I'm going to mess this up even more by trying to get more than one thing with this. So that's there, right? So one, two is there. Two. How many are here? One, two. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten. Oh, right, because yes, there should be nine of these. Three, six, nine. And then, tenth one is the bottom one to boost it up because this has to go two slots first. So that's two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we're gonna put this here like that. Right? That lines up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That should be enough for what I need. So that's going to go there. That goes there. That goes there. I, I am out of materials. Uh, well, that's... that's that. Okay. Do I have any more down here? I really hope I do. I do. And in fact, I have a container that also has more of them. Uh, I don't think this is enough, but...
That was close. Alright, let's see if I can get this. Mind you, most of the reason why I am running out of materials is because I'm trying to make this nice and neat. And making things nice and neat always takes more resources. Alright, so this needs to go to not there, not there, but to there. And this goes to... Nope, nope, you are wrong. You go to there. And now I have petroleum coke in my inventory. That's lined up with that. So I need one, two, which lines up with that. Now this. That's lined up with that. That's lined up with that. So one, two, and that lines up with that. Now, fortunately, now that I've done that, I only actually have three of them to get across here. But it also means that I need to get these all the way up there. So I can't. This line is not helpful. Is that there? Guess we'll find out. Yep. There we go. Perfect. One, two, three, four. And then... One, two, three... Four. So that goes to there, that goes to there, and everything is piped up. Uh, everything is conveyored up. It is not piped. But everything has petroleum coke going to it. It needs water. So water is the last thing that I need now. I'm going to see if I can dump this in. There we go. Alright. This is fluctuating all over everywhere. Oh, now we're steady. Kind of. It's, it's probably the fluctuation from this, because... This is finally pulling, so it's 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 going to be a little weird for a bit. Okay. So, I have no idea how I'm getting this water here. Honestly, I just I I don't know. And, I mean, I've already spent so much time on this already, and I don't have enough materials. So, what I'm going to have to do is I am going to have to call it a day. Uh, I am tired. This has been a roller coaster of emotion. And it's been a struggle. However, this is also working. And I'm quite. Oh. I'm quite hiccupy. Um. No. I. 
I am quite happy uh, with the way this is turning out. I have already gained a lot in power. And this whole process is just designed to be able to um, process or create uh, plastic and rubber in order to also have power. So the power part and the machines are all hooked up. The only thing that I need is to get some water here and I'm I'm spiking at 3000 megawatts so far. And on the low side uh it's it's like 28 2800 so considering I was like 2200 that's like six to eight eight hundred more megawatts now obviously I'm not I haven't reached the point where I am actually at a net positive yet but uh, like uh, I'm reaching the end of the road perfect I mean I'm happy with how this is turning out we just have to figure out what we're doing at this uh, pipe it all in and then go from there but yeah thank you very much for watching uh, if you like the video please like if you want to see more uh, vid of these videos or uh, keep up to date on the new videos that end up coming out uh, please subscribe if you want to join in on the streams I stream every day uh, at least once a day uh, most of the time it is uh, uh, after 5 a.m. Eastern Standard Time sometimes a little bit later um, and on my days off, I sometimes do an afternoon stream depending on uh, what game I feel like playing a little more of. Uh, so, because the schedule is a little bit off, it's best to just subscribe if you want to join the streams because that should give you a notification on when uh, I start the stream and then you can jump on. Uh, say hello. Uh, ask questions, offer comments. Um, if you know something that I don't, which is very highly likely that you do, uh, uh, feel free to let me know. Constructive criticism is always welcome. Uh, but that is it for me. Thank. Uh, have a great rest of your day, and bye bye.